what is up my Irish bagels and welcome back to another video so today guys what i want to talk to you all about is spider-man no way home and we know that the film is in post-production meaning they are polishing up the movie and adding special effects to it news has come out recently that both marvel studios and sony have hired or rehired you could say the visual effects teams from both Tobey Maguire Spider-Man movies and Andrew Garfield Spider-Man movies. A new report stating the visual effects teams and artists are coming back from the original Spider-Man movies by Sam Raimi and the two amazing Spider-Man movies that were made by Mark Webb. This brings up the question, why would Sony slash Marvel Studios be hiring these people for Spider-Man No Way Home? And the simple answer is because they worked on the Tobey Maguire Spider-Man and Andrew Garfield Spider-Man. They have experience with them for visual effects and how the effects should look when either Tobey Maguire's Spider-Man or Andrew Garfield Spider-Man is on screen or even when all three of them are on screen at the same time. They know how they move, the way they look, the way they swing, the way they pose, even the web itself is different, the movement is different from all three of them. Each Spider-Man ranging from Tobey Maguire's to Tom Holland's Spider-Man are different with the visual effects. This is all but confirming both Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield to be in Spider-Man No Way Home and the MCU. And this will also help with the old villains that are supposedly coming back as well. For example, Rhino, Lizard, Electro, Green Goblin and Sandman. This is the end of the video guys, I hope you did like it, if you did please hit the like button right beside the like button is the subscribe button that you can hit to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Beside that is the notification bell that you can hit to stay up to date whenever I upload a video to my YouTube channel. I also live stream weekly on my Twitch channel, link to that will be down in the description below. Once you're there you can hit the follow button and hit the notification bell to stay up to date whenever I go live over there. I also have a Twitter account that I manually update whenever I upload a video or whenever I go live on my Twitch. I'm also going to be doing live streams and TikToks. Link to that will be down in the description below for my Twitter and my TikTok will be down in the description below as well. And I will be uploading to that shortly. So go hit the follow button on both my Twitter and my TikTok. But yeah, this is it guys. Hope you like, favorite, subscribe and peace.